Hello, ladies and gents, it is the Macho Miracle here, aka Dyson, and welcome to uh, this commentary over some slowdown bull gameplay. And this commentary is about slowdown bull and how awesome it is and whatnot. Uh, I did get a press release uh, thingy McJigger uh, about it. Uh, so I got the game only uh, I got the game basically the same day that it came out. <laughs> That's I got a press version of it the day that it came out. And I also bought the game because I want to help towards the cause that they're doing. Uh, Slow Down Bull is a Steam game made by Insomniac Games. If you don't know who Insomniac Games is, they're the guys that created Ratchet and Clank. They also created the Resistance series. They created the mobile game Outer Knots, which is really fun. They created the game Fuse, and they also created the Xbox One game Sunset Overdrive. Oh, and they're creators of Spyro the Dragon. But I think the only two that they actually developed were Spyro uh, the Dragon and Spyro the Dragon 2 Ripto's Rage, I think. They might have done more, but I'm not 100% sure on that, so don't quote me on all that. But they did create all of those games. <laughs> I do know for sure. So uh, but so they're, they're an awesome company, and... They're, they're my favorite gaming company, honestly. Ratchet & Clank has always been my favorite. Resistance was great. Outer Nost is probably my favorite mobile game. Uh, Fuse was pretty good. A lot of people didn't like it, but I had fun with it. Uh, didn't really... I still haven't played it much. I need to beat it. I haven't even beat it yet. <laughs> too, many, too much stuff going on. But anyways, this game, Slow Down Bull, uh, it's a Steam game. So if you have Steam, you should go pick it up. It's only $5.99 uh, American. It... Uh, is they're in partnership right now with Starlight Children Found Starlight Children's Foundation. Sorry, uh, it's 50% of everything they make off of this game is going to that foundation, and it's only six bucks. It's a really fun game, and, it's, and it has full controller compatibility, so that's really nice. And, but I've only played it with mouse and keyboard so far. Uh, I and the gameplay you're seeing is only the first time I ever played it. Clips from the first time I played it, which was like a I don't know, it was like 20 minutes of it, so, uh, but I've played through more of it and it's really fun. I, I, I'm getting more used to it because, uh, the con uh, you know, I'm more used to controls where I'm using the full controller, not just a certain part of the controller, but it's really fun and it's a very simple game. Here, uh, I'll, here I'll read what Insomniac Games has said about it. And the question is, so what exactly is Slow Down Bull? Uh, players steer Esteban, an overachieving bull who just wants to make beautiful art, to success in this action-collecting game. But the more you steer Esteban, the higher his stress level elevates. And uh, now my dad is calling me. My gosh, every time I try to do a freaking recording, this is what happens. And I'm back. I'm gonna have to edit out this little phone call there with my daddy. Uh, that's the third phone call that I've got in this recording. Uh, first my mom, then my nana, now my dad. Uh, crazy, crazy. Anyways, back to good old Esteban. Uh, you know, he. I just ended with you know the higher his stress level. Uh, you know, he get his stress level elevates the more you steer him. You can't move around too much or he starts to freak out. And uh, that's not good. But you collect as many decorations and complete each level before time expires. Uh, but if you trigger an Esteban Rampage from stressing him out too much, uh, he destroys the decorations that he's trying to gather. And you also gotta watch out people for carrying bases and there's people carrying like glass panes and when you hit them you lose all the decorations you're carrying because there's like deposit places. Uh, when you lose them all, you gotta go pick them up, and they're flashing, getting ready to disappear, and that's not fun. You can probably tell by the gameplay. I wasn't very good at it at first, but I've had a lot of fun with it. I was using the mouse to control him at first, um, until they told me you can use the arrow keys. That made it a little bit easier. Uh, after I started playing it more, I also tried out my Xbox 360 controller, and that was, uh, and yeah, it's full controller support and nothing, no, no lag at all. It's perfect. And uh, that made it a little bit easier, but I went back to the arrow keys just because I uh, didn't want to use my controller the whole time. It is a PC game, so I kind of want to use my keyboard. <laughs> so, anyways, it's a it's a great game, and it's for a good cause. You should buy it if you have Steam. 
and uh, it's just a it's just a fun little indie game, really. It's cool that Insomniac made this. Uh, it's really fun too. So uh, let's see. I think that's I think that's everything. But yeah, you should definitely pick it up, guys. It's so fun. Insomniac's great at making games. So I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Bye bye. Love your faces. Bye, slow down bull. Like right now. Yeah.